Nito, you would my, say? My, yes, Nito. That's a good word for it. All right, we got Mewtwo versus Darkrai. Mewtwo, okay. Uh, I don't know if I... I'd say things about, hey, Darkrai has a rough, except this is Shadow mm -hmm. Cat's Darkrai. Is all yeah. Level. <laughs> but, uh, this is Darkrai, like, I, like, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not a huge fan of the character, but Shadow Cat's Darkrai is just always super fun to watch. I just love his thought process that you can just see in his play. Mm -hmm. And same goes for um, Mewtwo's Mewtwo. I just love watching this. It's so, so, like, thought out and just so well prepared. I just love watching these characters. All right. Going out here to skill phase. Yeah, yeah, Shadow Cat is kind of getting stuck in the corner. Trying to get, work his way out of it right now, but still, he's here just slowly working his way in. That puddle is so hard. Mm -hmm. It's just disappearing. Like right. There we go. Okay, there we go. That's what Shadow Cat needed right there. Ooh! Nice combo into Theatrics. it. I mean, it's mostly on Oh my god, it keeps going. It keeps going. Why like, would it bunny. Why would it stop? Like, <laughs> didn't have a reason to, and now we have BDR going. Uh -huh. Wow, that's still able to shield that. All right. Shadow Cat is really just playing super reactionary off of Mewtwo right now. Look at that. Yeah, he's just waiting for Mewtwo to make an option. Goodness gracious. Mm -hmm. Reset oh, the dark Rai optimal meta, whatever has evolved. Mm -hmm. Shadow Cat is the dark Rai optimal. <laughs> like, this is just it right here. Man! Nice, dark pulse. That was a nearly, that was just like a perfect dual phase right there from dark Rai. Like, he just did everything he wanted, and uh, Mewtwo just cannot find an option here. Double portals and magic up, what you gonna do? Man, the thing is, only 5 what HP. Like, even if you, like, take the hit, like, you still gonna die. Like... Ah, wow! Okay. Gutsy. The bravery. Actually, also pop burst. How, how do you have burst already? You're a dark ride. You, you, know you remember that dual phase? We just <laughs> got away with everything. That'll <laughs> do true. it. That will do it. That, that mute. Um, Shadowcat just like was commanding that entire gamer. That he commanded the pace so much. Okay. How do you feel about Magic Carp support in a nutshell? Magic Carp. I think it's a really, really solid support because it forces your opponent to um, maneuver it. Like, it, you, like, your opponent has to change their game plan according to Magic Carp. And that's something with the Dark Rai, uh, kicks like that depend on your opponent's actions. Really, really important. Mm -hmm. See, Shadow Cat got a turn right there, but Mutator just got so much advantage going and on there. And the Bad Dream. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I love that Magic Carp. Like, I'm gonna push buttons. Yeah, you saw, you saw right there. Like, if, if, um, Magic Carp weren't there to protect from that, um, JX, it will have ended a lot sooner. But now, reset opportunity. Toad Kiss. What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh, What's I, the button? I think that was punishable. Okay. <gasps> oh, I don't think Dark Rai could. Alright, so All right. we got loops. Here we go. Here we go. Loops. Fruit loops. Oh, it's... Fruit <laughs> loops. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Raw, How much is this doing? Uh, that does oh. an ouchy amount of HP. Ooh, okay. It's still gonna be such a hard time coming. Shout okay, never mind. Got making buff. this work. It's now pretty even right now, but... Goodness. Ooh, is that, is that it? Oh. Not quite. 2 HP left and only 15 seconds on the clock. Man, this is so, so close. Oh my goodness. Shadowcat just probably wishing for something to connect here. He's got magic armor, no time to use it. Yep. KO. All right. Really, up. okay. There we go. Really, really good stuff there from Shadowcat. I think he was just um, just dominating that first round and just got into his head so much. And that amazing comeback he made happen too. Like that Dream Eater, like, was really just what he needed. Like that big comeback, that mm -hmm. X factor. Sometimes you just really just need to throw that out and make something happen. Because if it weren't for that, if it was like a regular grab or something like that, is, he will have just had to work through so much more and so little more time. Mm -hmm. Okay, getting a change here from Mutator. All right, sticking to the Mewtwo. The Shadow Mewtwo, I don't know if it's showing up much in bracket today. I haven't been keeping track. I personally haven't seen Every it. Every time I've seen him on stream, at least he was playing Mewtwo. Mm -hmm. So, I wonder if he's going to be keeping that up here. Anyway. Going into here. Ah, yeah. So you just on, gotta do it. <laughs> you just right gotta do it. Yeah. It's the only thing that just says no to everything Dark Rai puts. Yeah, exactly. Like, of course, like Dark Rai's plenty of counterplay to it, but it's like. Ah, yeah. Nasty plot is so big. You just want to grab him. Again, <laughs> you just kind of gotta do it, you know. <laughs> Dark Rai has bad frame data. Like, I love how Mutator does like the push out of the fire spin to like make it a bit more threatening. Mm. Okay, here we go. Now he's got dark corner. Yeah, this is just the, the this is the blender here. Or Ooh. or the blender can go the other direction. Awesome conversion. The thing is, he can do as much as he wants in that combo as long as it ends in uh, dark void because that dark void resets the PSP. He can do whatever he wants. I love jumping over what Darker does because he wants like two X to Y. Mm-hmm. So mm -hmm. All right, so Mewtwo finding something here. Interesting, he's going for the Selby. I've seen a lot of people using Selby um, as dark ride today. I've seen it used. 
I mean, he was a just for support. Yeah, we got hyper yeah, once he, more until it stops working. Yeah, so uh, it's, it's really interesting because it just shuts down um, BDR. If you're having a hard time in the field, it just says no. No oh, more field. Yeah. I think it's a really, really cool uh, meta choice. I like it. Nice trap. Alright. Here we go. BDR again. Nice conversion. Up and over. Combo. How's he got? Oh, dropped it actually. <laughs> Catches the vulnerable, the no more bad dreams for mm -hmm. you. Alright. Yeah. Oh, man. See, it's such a reversal, because last time, Shadowcat was really just dominating the entire game, but now Mutator... It is. He's going to take game two. Man, okay. <laughs> Something happened in there. He figured it out. Someone talked into his earpiece, giving him the giving him the details. Really, really nice um, adaptation there. I, feel like, I think he realized that he just needed to stay in a lot, um, because if he got, gave Shadowcat any amount of time, then um, or any amount of respect, he just wouldn't get one come back. That's kind of why I think doing that... Um, like the raw hype beamer, just all those grabs where you just like not like I'm, I'm just gonna make you just keep going between phase and phase. You don't get to build up anything. <laughs> I think that was a big part of why I was working out because Shadowcat had no time to establish himself. He's got to be thinking about the support. Like, granted, he didn't need it, but it didn't help him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's exactly what he's doing right now. Cause I don't think he didn't use Selby at all. But then again, he didn't really need to. Like, he was in. The, he was never in the situation where Selby's helpful. It's it's kind of hard to gauge because. The last match just went so different. Like, mm -hmm, what exactly. Do I need? But, and like, it, and the thing is, it, it went so different, like not because of the support choice or anything like that. Mm -hmm. I think it's just in a matter of play style. So I, it's really interesting because if you keep the play style he's doing, going super aggressive, super like read heavy, I think Tokus will be better. But like Selby's just that amazing backup option. Like it's like where it's it's your panic button. Like okay, I'm done. You are having way too much fun in this phase. I want to say no. I don't <laughs> like it. Not a fan. Yo, Magikarp versus Magikarp, though, wasn't that big buddy. <laughs> Magikarp proccing Magikarp, there we go. <laughs> I think I that, mean, that has happened a lot, I think. Yeah. Or at least I mean, the Wii U days. Yeah, there. Magikarp's just a super good support. I can't blame people for using it. <laughs> uh, you two are really putting a lot of thought in this. I respect that. Mm -hmm. is this, uh, this is a is very this important winners? match. Yes, this is winners. Okay. And this is still best of three? Yeah. Okay. yeah I think the winner of this will go into winner's semis. Yes, okay. Nice. Snow gift. Let's go. <laughs> nice. We got trusty mm -hmm. Togekiss. Trusty Togekiss. Yep. Mimikyu coming out from Shadow Cat. He wasn't uh, using that before, that was he? That is interesting. I don't think so. if he was, I did not. I think that's like a lot of people would use Mimikyu a lot right now. I think it's a really, really cool choice. I think it adds something that a lot of other sports don't. See, people kept dropping Mimikyu because they're like, oh, you can just counterplay it. I'm like, mm -hmm. okay, well, why are people using it now? Yeah, I think but you can counterplay like every support in the game. Like it, th that's why I like uh, like so much that there's so much um support counterplay. So like there's no like one just overpowering support. There's something like Mew, like you just have to change how you're approaching your opponent. Yeah. Alright, Toga's coming out here. Alright. You see here, Shadow kept pushing Mutate into the corners, removing his options, can't move anywhere right now. Suck without bad dreams, we'll, we'll get into that. Alright, okay, get something set up here, nice combo going. Oh no, he dropped it. The net does it. Yeah. This yeah. does not work for me. The, 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 he's just trapping that snowman in the distance over there. That's fine. It's cool. <laughs> Mutator taking the corner back for himself. Oh, Alright, nice. Going for the full conversion. Oh, oh boom. Ow. That's the Mutator special right there. <laughs> I remember the day like, he put that on Twitter. I was like, this is stupid. I hate this. <laughs> so dumb. Close the distance. Dark ride. Say no to the corner right now. Into right. the net. Yep. Full combo here. Going for the full. These setups, yeah, with dark I, pulse and all that. He's got, he's got that like down to a science there. He knows exactly how to do it every right, single time. Oh, oh, unfortunate, but good call for you. Sometimes mutators. you just gotta do it. I mean, like, <laughs> it, it's, it beats virtually everything Dark is gonna do. Say for if he can even jump over it. I just love that there's like a whole game of like counterplay, and then, and then, then eventually just do a hyper beam. <laughs> just gotta check him real quick. I mean, Shadowcat is doing great setups, but they take so much time to set up. It's like, I'd okay, Mutator, movement around all those pickups was so good. He, like, he kept that advantage even through all those pickups. You just yes. gotta when do it, it! When the field is fresh and, and chewy, mm -hmm. then you can. Fresh and chewy. <laughs> <laughs> when it's all fresh and clear. Alright, there we go. Hyper beam, and you got very little. And Mutator is just like really just knowledge. It's just knowledge checking. Um, well, not so knowledge checking. just really. Um, Playing out of um, Shadow Play's <laughs> comfort zone. That's scary. He, okay, mm -hmm. Shadow Play's just doing super aggressive, trying to close distance there, and the Mutator's just like playing with that. He's like, I have tokens, I'll just back up. What is Mimikyu actually for? Has it been done mm -hmm. anything yet? Um, okay. I think it's just, um, he, he did it earlier trying to do the walk up step, but then he just got hyper beamed, so. 
It's like, I would understand if it was to get in bad dreams, but I don't mm -hmm. know what you're supposed to do. All right, yep, and here we go. Yep, there see, we go. Yeah, it just—it's more of a sort of denial, and it gives you um, while your opponents like trying to play oh, around mimic you, uh, it lets you set up traps and stuff. I think that's what you always going for. Right. Nice purple punch. Going in, going in. Lots of chip going. That chip's actually super important. There's only ten seconds left. Regular that character. could be it, and with and actually with the um. <gasps> oh, he thought he'd be safe. No. The real BC mix up. Oh my god. That's it. That's it. Yep. Oh. That was it. Try to get another setup going. Can reach. <laughs> There was, I don't think there was a single thing um, Chaka could have done to get that chipped out. Cause he Nothing could, reasonable. Because then Mutek really. could have just CDC back. <laughs> yeah. There was very little. That was like a checkmate situation. Mm. Good job for Mutator. Mm -hmm. I believe he takes the set. Yep. yep, that is the set. He'll be advancing. Um, and I'm here, and we have Thanks Watt and Eclipse. The oh, other boy. winner sides match going on here. Hello? The run back from last oh, year. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, um, yeah. yeah. They did do this last year, didn't they?